both games could have went either way. You know, uh, the first night we got into overtime and we had a breakdown about a minute and 30 seconds in and they converted on it. And then Saturday was a tight game, just like Friday night. And um, they scored with two and a half minutes left. So certainly not the outcome that we wanted, but I thought our guys battled and competed and played really hard. And, you know, that's the type of games that we're going to have the rest of the year. Mercyhurst is probably the most offensively talented team in the league. Sometimes because they are so offensive, they do give up chances uh, defensively. And it's going to be important for us to take advantage of those. And when we get in the power play, score on the power play. But it's really going to be the same game plan that we have all the time, which is to play really hard away from the puck and try to generate and manufacture goals when we have it. Buffalo was six and a half hours and Mercy Earth is about seven and a half. And coming back to back, you know, you have a long trip back on Saturday night. We got home about five o'clock in the morning on Sunday. We gave the guys Monday off. They had a lift, but it's, it's more about guys getting their rest and us just being smart with our practice times and what we're doing and try to conserve as much energy because the bus trips do take a lot out of you. And, but it's mental toughness too, and it's the schedule. And other teams in our league have to do the same thing over the course of the year. So we just have to get through it and try to prepare ourselves the best we can. And then we got to put it out of our mind and play the best hockey we can this weekend.